the second Iraq war, controversial before, during and after the event. The people who were actually there can never forget it. Before I went out, I could hear my, my heart beating off my body armour and, and my adrenaline. And initially it was only three of us on the ground, so three of us trying to take on, you know, 20 militia fighters, you know, armed to the teeth. It was a big ask. Colour Sergeant Brian Wood won the Military Cross for his actions in the Princess of Wales's Royal Regiment. Yeah, I kind of... Was, it was an out-of-body experience, if I'm honest. It was, it was full of aggression, emotion and just commitment, really. And it was just trust in your other fellow soldiers that they were going to commit with you, which I had no doubt they would have. And, um, and we go and we just kept on bounding. Sergeant Wood fought in the Battle of Danny Boy. He and his comrades were later accused of murder and torture, accusations which were finally dropped three years ago. It was just mind-blowing. To be honest, I didn't really take it serious. I was like, you know, really? This is just an absolute joke. You know, we've, my regiment and my men on that ground that day and what they carried out was impeccable. As he viewed the new memorial, Sergeant Wood was satisfied one of the human rights solicitors involved has been struck off. But he also knows £22 million has been paid out in compensation, even though the Ministry of Defence disputes claims of maltreatment. What do you think about that figure? I mean, it's the public purse, it's people's money, right? And I just, I feel gutted about that. And I, and I apologise for that. And I know I shouldn't, I've got nothing to apologise for, but to get punished for our actions by people who have got no credibility. I mean, they haven't walked you know, a metre in my shoes for them then to ask questions about my decision making on the battlefield. I'm, I mean, it's just beyond me. Before, during and especially after, Iraq remains the most controversial of wars. Simon Viger, 5 News.